AI video editing tools are seriously evolving fast. So in this video, we're gonna share the best AI tools for video editing that we recommend right now so that you can create videos in a fraction of the time. Now it's been really tough to narrow this down to just five top apps right now, but app number one is Descript. This is one that I have been a massive fan of for a long time, and they really changed the game as far as making editing really, really simple by allowing you to edit your videos from text. So yes, this concept was around for a long time, but it was Descript that really made this easy and accessible. And it's actually evolved now to be this amazing content creation machine. It's actually what I'm using right now to record this video. I'm recording directly into Descript. And this is how we make all of our YouTube videos and even course related content for our accelerator program. It's all done in Descript. But in terms of AI functionality and why we love this so much, yes, it's gonna automatically transcribe your videos or your audios so that you can edit it as if you were editing a Word document. But it's also got amazing functionality to make your audio sound so much better by enhancing the vocals, by removing background noise. Their AI studio sound feature is awesome. There's also AI tools to help you edit faster as well. With one click, you can remove all of the gaps, all of the silence area. You can easily remove any pauses, any any filler words like um, are, or so. And there's even a new feature now which will let you automatically remove any double ups or any retakes, and it will help you pick the best one for that. This is something that's helped us speed up our editing so much because I'm someone who tends to make a lot of mistakes when I'm recording. You can also train Descript to learn your voice as well. So if you do need to make any minor changes or fix any mistakes that happened at the time of recording, you can literally just type out what you want and it will say it back in your words, in your voice. And there's even now an eye adjustment tool. So if you're someone who is reading from a script, maybe you're looking off to the side or below your camera, it'll automatically move your eyes back so that it looks like you're making eye contact with your viewers. Now, when I first saw this, it was a little freaky, a little strange but well done, it looks awesome. Now, obviously there's so much more in here and you can use this for podcasts, for video creation, for so much stuff. And we do have a full breakdown of reviews and tutorials and things, which I'll link in the description box below. But in terms of our workflow, I love that we also have the ability to export from Descript into other programs like DaVinci Resolve, where we can then take our editing to the next level with more pro grade tools too. Now in terms of pricing, there's a few different options. There is a free plan where you can jump in and have a play around. There's also a trial of some of the more pro level features as well. But beyond free, this is where you can jump on the hobbyist plan for $12 per month. I'm currently looking at annual billing, so it's a little bit more if you just want month to month. Or there's a creator plan here for $24 a month, which this is the plan that we use, unlocking 4K video capabilities and pretty much all of the AI features. Now there is also one other plan above that, the business plan for $40 per month billed annually, which it says gives you unlimited access to full professional AI suite. And it gives you more transcription hours and more minutes of AI generated speech per month as well. Tool number two is CapCut. This is another one that we talk about a lot on this channel, and it really packs a punch in terms of all the AI functionality that's in there. It's probably the most advanced AI-wise video editing tool out there right now. Now, this is an app that works on desktop, so there's a Mac version, there is a Windows version, and there's also an iOS and Android version as well. But there is also a web-based version which does unlock some different AI tools as well. But where I find the best use of this is on the mobile or on the desktop versions of this app. So CapCut does have some of the same features that Descript does in terms of letting you edit from text and removing filler words and removing silence. It's not as good as Descript, but still awesome that it's in here as well. It's also got the ability like Descript to automatically add in captions and text for your videos as well. But some of the standout AI features for me in here are things like Relight. So if we come over here to Relight, let's enable this. We can see this is going to let us add essentially lights to our scene here and adjust the lighting after this video has already been shot. And you can see it's taking into context where there are people in the shot. So you can see it's adjusting the light there on my face, but also applying it to the background area as well. So in this case, we've added a warm light. We can also add cool lights. So you can see these subtle differences we're able to easily make really, really quickly and easily. And obviously we can dial this in further. We can change the color of those lights. We can change the intensity, the radius, the distance. There's a lot of customization in here. There's also things like an image enhancer built in. There is AI expansion as well. So if we enable this now, and let's maybe we scale this down a little bit. 
And now let's choose Edit Expanded Area. And then go ahead and generate here for us. And it's gone ahead and expanded our shot here for us. And look, it's done a pretty good job. Obviously we can regenerate, we can make adjustments to this, but I mean, that's pretty good. Just like Descript, there's built-in voice enhancers in here as well to make you sound better, to remove background noise. There's also the ability to translate your video into other languages as well. And it does sync your lip movements to try and match those other languages and what you're saying in the other languages as well. Another standout for me is the AI color correction. So this auto adjust tool here, this does a really good job of making color correction easy. This is normally something that I would advise people not to use is the auto adjustment tools, but this one does a really good job. Now, obviously again, there's so much more in here that I'm not covering off. These are some of the standout features for me. And again, I've got more links in the description to help you dive in further with this. Now in terms of pricing, there is an amazing free version of CapCut, but a lot of those AI functions are only in the pro version right now, which you can access for around $8 per month. The next tool is an amazing AI plugin for Adobe Premiere Pro, and it's called AutoCut. So obviously for this one, you will need to be using Adobe Premiere Pro, and this is an add-on to it. But it's got a bunch of really amazing, really useful AI functions that it then adds to Premiere. So you can see here, it says that automate manual editing tasks and save hours. So it has the ability to help you add captions into your videos. So it's automatically gonna transcribe your videos and add that text easily to your screen. Just like Descript and CapCut, you can automatically remove the silences and any quiet pieces as well. But the standout features for me with this and where I think this is really, really powerful is the podcast editing, where it will analyze the different speakers that you might have in your podcast or in your video. And it's automatically going to edit that down for you. And it's essentially gonna choose your camera angles based on who it is that's speaking. And it does this so fast. This one feature, if you're editing podcasts or long form interviews, is gonna save you so much time. And it's also got the ability to automatically zoom in or essentially create jump cuts for you in and amongst those transitions and edits automatically for you as well. There's also an amazing auto B-roll feature here as well. After it's transcribed your video, it knows what's happening in there. And this will help you go and source stock footage B-roll clips that you can then easily bring into your project as well. This is another massive time-saving feature that is pretty awesome. Now, in terms of pricing, there is a free trial available, so you can jump in and you can check this out, and you actually don't need to even enter a credit card to do the trial version. But then up from that, they do have a basic plan, which is pretty basic. You can see there's not much unlocked on that, but that starts at $6.60 per month build annually. But really, the AI plan here is where the magic happens. At $14.90 per month build annually. This is where pretty much everything gets unlocked. The next AI video editing tool is open clip and this is another one that I'm a massive fan of. These guys have really been the leader in the space for AI repurposing of content. So essentially you can upload a video and their AI will go through and analyze that content and help you pull out what it thinks will be trending or viral or engaging pieces of content from that longer form content. And it does this so well. We've tried so many of these tools, but we keep coming back to Opus Clips because it seems to find the best clips. And it's only kept getting better and better since it first came out. So even on their website here, one long video, 10 viral clips, create 10 times faster. Pretty simple promise. But it's also so much more than just helping you find these clips from within your longer videos now, these snippets. It's actually going through and analyzing your entire video and it will automatically edit some of these clips and pull different pieces from different sections of your video to create something engaging. But it's crazy how well this works. It easily helps you add all the text on screen to make your video engaging. It'll automatically reframe your shot for you to keep the content piece or the most engaging piece in frame. And it will even now help you create something even more engaging by automatically adding in B-roll as well. So it's gonna help you find additional footage to help you create something that was different from what you first created or the video that you're repurposing, it's really helping you create a standalone piece of content instead of just a snippet that's been chopped out of a longer form piece. So you don't just have to use this for repurposing or just creating shorts or TikTok style content. You can now actually use this to create widescreen or square videos as well. And you have the ability just to do this automatically where you let it decide and it go and find all the clips or you can actually jump in and you can adjust a lot of this stuff to really dial everything in and almost like manually edit things in here as well. And there's also a bunch of templates in here that you can customize up or even create and save your own templates in here if you wanna have a consistent theme or look to your videos. 
And in terms of pricing, there is a free version, which is great if you wanna jump in, have a play around. It does have a watermark, so you will wanna jump on the starter or pro plan to remove that and to unlock all of the features. But if you wanna unlock everything and really get the full experience of Opus Clip, that's where you wanna be on the pro plan, which is currently even cheaper than the startup plan at $14.50 US per month. Again, built annually. And I gotta keep saying it, there's so much more in here and with all the tools than what I'm currently showing you. So that brings us then to tool number five, which is Runway ML, which is another beast of a platform that does so much stuff, but it all really revolves around AI. But the big difference with this one is it's more generative AI. So this is where we can ask AI to create us stuff that has never existed before or to create a video from an image. So in terms of video creation or making B-roll from nothing, this tool is phenomenal. You can literally just type out what you want this thing to create and it's going to make it out of nothing. So at the time of filming this, Gen 3 Alpha is their latest release on this video generation software or AI. And they've got some amazing examples on their page that you can go and check out of things that have been created either from an image or from a text prompt. And these look so real. So they've even got a section on their website here, photorealistic humans. And just have a look at how real these are. I mean, these are scary real. And we can see the prompt here that it was given, an astronaut walking between stone buildings. A middle-aged sad bald man becomes happy as a wig of curly hair and sunglasses falls suddenly on his head. I mean, that's pretty specific, but I mean, how awesome does this look? How real does this look? And we actually did another video where we compared this to some of the other tools out there like this. So again, I'll have that linked in the description box below. So just scrolling through the tools that they have on here, obviously we've got the generative video, which is what I'm most pumped on in here. They've got generative audio as well, where we can generate audio from text. It's got lip sync in here as well. So you can upload your audio and an image and it's going to synchronize the two for you. So it's gonna make people's lips move, which is just crazy. There's background removal, there's text to image, text to video. There's all sorts of stuff in here. So like there is so much, but the standout feature for me with this is the generative video up the top here. It's just crazy how awesome this is. And in regards to pricing, there is a basic free plan. It says here it's free forever, where you can jump in, you can test this stuff out. If you're doing videos in here, there is a limit of 720p for the quality of those videos. But to enhance that, that's where you can jump on the standard plan, which does up to 4K videos and gives you longer video times and more generations per month, or up to the pro or unlimited plans here to unlock all the features and functionality. So those are my top AI video editing tools right now. I am excited to see where this goes already. The changes from the last time we made this video to this video are huge and it's changing fast. So let me know down in the comments, which is your favorite tool, whether it was one of these or whether you're geeking out on something that I didn't mention in this video, let me know. As always, we've got a bunch of other resources and tools in the description box below to help you even further, along with some reviews and tutorials on some of these tools that we just mentioned as well. And I will see you in the next video.